look at DFW Airport this morning. It's almost 8, 40, 70 degrees out there. Just back from New York Fashion Week, Jean-Philippe is here with a look at what is hot for fall. So what was it like? You were doing, you were oh, doing some of the models' hair and oh, stuff there? Oh, that was there? great. We did three shows and it was amazing. It was a great experience and I loved it. A little nuts. So you're going to show us what's hot for fall. Yes, yeah, so I'm all, trying we, to bring it here to Dallas. Okay, so we're doing the messy bob. Let's take a look at Vanessa Hudgens because she seems to pull this off pretty well. And you said this is pretty much easy for, for anyone to do. Yeah, because, you know, the bobs are always classic that come in, in, uh, in, mm -hmm. style, or in style and then you yeah. texturize them and then you can give it an edge to it. Mm -hmm. You see you have the ombre color we have the ombre dark it's still hot huh? it's still hot it's it's a little bit more settled than what we used to do but okay. it's really dark on the roots and it goes down it's like really razored at the bottom and also the makeup if you look like uh, copper and uh, plum lipstick is really in for the uh, oh really for and the how fall do you know winter. at what length you should do uh, your it bob. depends around your faces yeah, this this shape uh, here uh, of carly is mm -hmm. oval but the rounder the face the longer the bob and usually you kind of like slant it a little bit more when it's a round face rounder the face the longer the if bob if you have a okay. narrow long face you don't want to slant it too much okay all right let's go on to the uh, uh, pixie look and uh, here's julianne Huff. Yes. And, and she definitely pulls this look off, and our model does as well. Love this look. Now, this is kind of like, uh, it's pixie-ish, so it's like uh, a pixie that's grown, uh, that, that's almost a bob, but it's not really a bob. We did a lot of pixie in the summer, so they kind of grown out now. Okay. So you definitely want to get some, like, dark colors on the roots, because it gives you a great um, kind of depth to the color right. and to the hairstyle so different and the pieciness. And my whole thing, if I, you know, with a shorter haircut, I feel like there's only one way you can wear it, but you're saying that's not the case because you can make this even more of you an can, evening look. The, the gels look are, are really in, so you can put some gel, put one side behind the ear with the gel, really curl it with the iron in the front, or you can slick it uh, to the side as well. Okay. There's, there's different, different ways to style well. it if you go to a cocktail party. Okay, know. let's take a look at uh, Lauren Conrad, recently married Lauren Conrad, and uh, she definitely has a look that a lot of people try to pull off. I know on Pinterest, seems like everyone's pinning her hair. <laughs> it's, it's called the chunky layers, so I mean, you know, you have like really chunky different PC layers. Now you see a root look, but you don't want to like just a small root look. You have to get it done in the salon where you grow out your roots quite a bit. Don't do just like, like a one or two inch. You want to go okay. to like three or four inch at least. And then you want to do some low lights underneath. Uh, to give you some depth to the hair. And this look is good on all face shapes. So this is it's something that It's all face that shape. Works, you know, huh? in Dallas we do it a lot. If you have a long face, I would add like a heavy bang to it. Okay. All right. Our last one, we got Taylor Swift, the modern shag. I love this look. This is a modern shag and we accentuate it by um, some uh, highlights coming from the underneath. Uh, the hair color uh, that we started was actually much lighter. Uh, what you want to do with the modern shag is you want to like remove the weight from the bottom. Okay. But you want to keep the shag used to have the shag it's used to have the. It's still pretty thick though. Yeah. yeah you used to have the Cute. the short sides. You want to make sure that the sides are long. All because right. if you cut them off, they'll be like too much like a mother. Yeah, and don't overstyle this look. This don't overstyle it, yes. Okay, love it, love it. You can find uh, Jean-Philippe's salon, by the way, on Lover's Lane in Dallas. We have a link on our website. Just uh, go to myfoxdfw.com. Click on links. You'll see it there. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Ladies, you look great.